Welcome and thank you all for joining our answer our presentation for the guidelines for installation from MicroStation Connect. So what we're going to be covering here is just, uh, let me go through our topics for discussion. We're going to be talking about some installation basics, and that will be for like a single installation. And also if you're setting up uh, an installation that would be shared with multiple colleagues in your organization. Uh, we'll talk about deployments and creating a deployment. Also some common issues that you might run into and then also how to troubleshoot those issues. And then afterwards, you're more than welcome to ask questions during the presentation, as Gina mentioned to our moderators. And then afterwards, if you have questions after the session, we'll be fielding those as well. Let's start with the installation basics. First of all, when installing MicroStation in any Bentley product, there are requirement or system requirements for installing the product. So the first step with any application is the installation is to ensure that it is compatible with the platforms on which it is to run. I should note also that this presentation or the PowerPoint slide is being shared. So some of these links, like the ones you see, MicroStation system requirements, download software, these are hyperlinks to wiki pages uh, on our community for this information. Also, it's important to note the requirements may change as the application updates. So uh, we always encourage you to continue to check that uh, wiki for the system requirements as this does change from time to time. And in addition, ensure that the version being installed is compatible with our other applications, uh, for example, project-wise. Now, um, you can download the software. Software is typically downloaded from our Connect portal. You will have to have a select ID to be able to log into that portal. And then also you will have to have download permissions or privileges. And this will be determined by your IT or site administrator who would be the local course person there in your organization. We here at Bentley would not have any control over who would have the download privileges. Now you can see how to download the software by the link to the wiki that I have below. And uh, this will also show you how to download the software. And I just wanted to just show how that page looks. And basically, once you click on the connection services and go to software downloads, if you have permissions, this is what you will see. If you've downloaded our software in the last year, uh, most of you are probably familiar with how this looks. So just wanted to show that screen. And of course, you would just select your software and uh, do so accordingly. And all that's done basically is shown in the wiki article. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you, and see you next time.